This is how you throw a football. <laughs> I don't know, are we getting audio enough with this? <laughs> Spike, clap, sink. Still got crack, crack. I'm open! I'm open! Oh. This is how you throw a football. So you want to learn how to throw a football, huh? It sounds like you want to learn how to throw a football. No, I already know. Can't you tell? Before we get started, we can't have deflated footballs like Tom Brady. Ah, uh, okay. Although we are using the NCAA football right now. Okay, what does that mean? It's a different size. Yeah, I'm going to hold it. No deflated footballs here. No deflated footballs. Yeah, no Tom Brady. No Tom Brady. But we're going to learn how to throw a perfect spiral like Tom Brady. Yes. Does he? Yeah. He has Why? a good spiral. Does he? Yeah, he's in the NFL. He's an elite quarterback. Well, is that a necessity? Yes. Um, the spiral allows it to travel further through the air. And it's a lot easier to catch a tight spiral than it is a wobbly pass. Okay. Because when the ball hits your hands, you want to catch it with the nose in between your two hands. Like a dog. Uh, this is Chica's POV. <laughs> Did you not know that was what I was going for? No. <laughs> oh, okay. So the first things first is your stance. Stance. Wherever you want to go, you point your toe. Point your toe where you want to go. So when you step, you point your toe. You point All right? your toe. Yes. Because if your toe's this way, the ball will follow where your step goes. So if you step this way, you'll end up throwing it more to the right. If you step this way and try and throw, you're going to throw more to the left. Okay. That's just basic mechanics. You learn later in life that you can use your body and contort to be able to throw differently. But general principle, toe, ball, go. So that was, is that a lie or is that truth? It's truth. You can, you learn later, you can adjust, but from a basic principle, that's, that's how you're initially taught. Toe points where you go. Okay. You have, you use your hips and your legs to drive the football. So they go from the hike. Hike. One, two, three, four. Uh, point, point, open, throw. Throw at the ground. Now, I'm not throwing the ball right now. I'm, we'll throw it. How can people know if you don't throw? I missed it. It wasn't the tightest spiral in the world. Wow. Now that's a tight spiral. <laughs> okay, hit me. Hit you with the ball? Hit me. Not fast. No, please, no fast. Ah! <laughs> that wasn't fast. <laughs> Look fast. All right, so to execute on what you taught me. All right, so. <laughs> I have the ball. Yeah. My toe points where it go. I'm going right to you. If this doesn't go exactly where my toe points, you're a liar. I don't know how to grip it. <laughs> hey! <laughs> that worked. Yeah. <laughs> it's general body mechanics. Uh-huh. What does that mean? It's just how your body works. You don't walk like this. I mean, I could. I mean, you can. I can walk like that. I, no you problem. can, but it's... <laughs> I can walk like that, no problem, man. My toes are going backwards. Am I going backwards in time? What? You can't run? No, I'm not, no, I'm not gonna challenge yeah, you. Yeah, I can. <laughs> <laughs> Don't hurt yourself, please, for the love of God. <laughs> okay, it's capturing everything. Okay. So to grip the football, mm -hmm. I for me, so I'm a lefty, right? So the main thing is you generally have your ring finger uh -huh. on the laces, index finger towards the back of the football. Okay. Why is that? Because when you want to snap your wrist, your grip here, your ring finger tenderly generally is the one that flicks and pulls the football to give it the nice tight spiral. Ah, so it's like a... Yeah. So when you pull, snap pull, pull. down, because right. your arm's gonna go like this. 
When you throw a baseball, you go across. When you throw a football, you go straight down. So it's like this, right? Yeah. I've got my ring finger on the the thing. On the laces. And I pull back and I flick down. (laughs) You're a dick. (laughs) And there are people that have bigger hands that'll adjust differently, but that's generally how to hold a football. No, you got the biggest hands. Okay, so ring finger on the laces, this towards the tip, like that. Thumb. You wanna get your thumb towards the bottom of the ball. Like, my hand's not that big, man. <laughs> so like, ah, oh. ah, oh. oh. it hurts. <laughs> you don't, don't have it like too tight. Do what's comfortable, but get your ring finger across the laces. Like that? Yeah. So when you bring it back, arm bent. Arm bent. Over the top, Over snap the top, down. Snap down. Straight down. Straight down. Yeah. So. All right. Okay. So here, step, turn your hips, throw. Here, step, turn hips, throw? Yeah. Okay. It's getting better. Is it? Snap your wrist. Snap my wrist. Like as fast as you can, snap it down. See? Okay. The key to get the nose down, because you're throwing it with the nose up, yeah. is to get higher on your release. So think higher. think about taking your hat off. Okay, thank you. Just, just so it's like close to your ear. Okay. You're taking your hat off. Take my hat. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. What's my other arm do? You can, usually you throw it like down. Like that? Yeah, because whatever helps you get your angular momentum at your hips. Okay. So there's a warm up that Dak Prescott does. Who's He's Dak a quarterback Prescott? for the Dallas Cowboys. You already knew I was gonna practice his opening his hips. So it's like discus when I, when I when I threw, you know, shot put and discus. There's a lot of like the hip movement. Yeah. Because you get your power from your legs and your hips. That's where you get the explosion. So that's how you get the power in your throat. Don't forget about snapping the wrist straight down. You're coming across. It's always how I do it. Like the first few are always decent and then I get worse. And then after 13 weeks of trying, I get better. That was a good throw. (laughs) It was low, but it had the spiral. And the reason it did is because you had a downward force on the football. So when you release it, if you get your arm up higher and <laughs> Good jump pass. I think you pretty much have it. So, I'm going to do it with my bad hand now. Okay. Following the same mechanics. Uh-huh. So, it's step, throw. Nice. And that's that's how I <laughs> practice uh, to make sure that I was you... teaching you right. Right, right, right. Was if I can do it with my bad hand, figure you can do it with your true hand. Okay. Where'd the football go? Yeah, let me look for it. Uh, it went, it went around here. I swear it did. Uh oh. What the fuck? Oh, it's, it's Ow. right here. <laughs> God damn it, Mark. <laughs> Call this a pump fake. Right? Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, that can be a pump fake. Oh, where's it gonna go? Right there! Oh, I think we should go home today, guys.
Boom! Touchdown! You did not flick your wrist at all. <laughs> all right. Well, watch this. La, la, la. From what I could tell, that was better. <laughs> what could you tell? Hard to see on a small screen. Okay. I'll make sure it comes towards you. Is that better? That was a lot better. Okay, good. Okay, so what's the difference between this and a NFL football? So the NFL football tends to be fatter and shorter. Fatter and shorter. But this one's fly. Flat? Yeah, I gotta pump it. Perfect for Tom Brady, am I right? No, 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 I want to see, I want to see what it's like to get the Tom Brady experience. Okay. If this is better, then, you know, maybe he's on something. Nope. It's better for catching, not throwing. Ah, I see, I see, I see. All right. Do you feel like you've improved? Yeah. Definitely. I'm going to hit that trash can. Down there, okay? All right. Green one. You hit it. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. So let's uh, reiterate the steps. Because right. if I can show you the steps, then I learned, right? Yeah. You could put the syringe down, man. No, it's good for stabbing. I, I know that, but not, not right now. Save the stabbing for later. Thank you. What it is. Where you point your toe, that's where the ball go. So you wanna receive the ball, do your dance, pick your poison, point your toe. Well, get ready to point your toe. I know where I want it to go. That little hole, see that hole in the, the brush center? Yeah. That's where I know my receiver's gonna get it. So I wanna make sure I point towards that when I plant and pivot my hips while I'm taking off my hat with my hands ring finger over the laces, thumb as far over on the other side as I can get it, finger towards the point, aim, ready, fire, plant, turn hips, up, hat, down, flick, perfect. Ah. You missed the hole. I, thanks, thank you. Yeah, that camera can zoom. Yeah. Thank you. Hole. Ah. Oh. I got it. I got it. Hole. Oh. I got it. Good throw. Good enough. Good enough. Good enough. And that's how you throw a perfect spiral football. Now I'm going to do it right down the barrel of the lens. Make sure to listen to the podcast. Try again. More at the lens. All right. Right down the barrel. Make sure to subscribe to our podcast for more handy sport tips. <laughs>